Hello, this is Jessica Pettit with Conversations That Matter. I've been doing this for about six months now, and I, along the way, have been asking audiences that I've been working with, what topics would you like to see a conversation that matters about? And I have a list. So here goes. First one, dealer's choice, except it's actually, I guess, the people playing the card game. So the player's choice. Uh, conversations that matter. That's what I'm going to do. Ready? Here we go. Number one, marriage. So here's what I thoughts are on marriage. Number one, some people don't believe in same sex or gay marriage. So here's my thought. Don't marry one then. There's a thought. There are also some straight people who don't support marriage. I can totally understand that. There's a lot of really weird things that go along with this like property and historical owning of another person. So don't get married if you don't want to get married. Don't marry somebody that you don't want to marry. If you do marry somebody that you want to marry, that seems like a good thing. So do that. And if you're already married, do it again. Renew your vows. Wouldn't that be fun? It's very interesting to me that we talk about how gay marriage is now legal, and yet we're actually kind of terrified as queer people that any moment it's going to become unlegal. It doesn't feel like marriage equality if at any point in time it can be taken away. That is a conversation that matters. So go have it. Go have it with other people. If you're married, renew that stuff. If you're married and you don't want to be married, really think about what you did and why you maybe won't let other people do it. And if you don't want other people to do it, why don't you not worry about what they're doing? It probably doesn't impact your marriage at all. That's just an idea. I don't know. I bet you have some other thoughts. Feel free to discuss amongst your friends. That is a conversation that matters.